Have you ever pondered the end of the world? Does the thought of humanity's ultimate destiny stir something deep within you? The answers to these profound questions have long been sought in the ancient texts, particularly in Christian eschatology. As the fabric of time weaves through the threads of prophecy, two dominant interpretations have emerged, preterism and dispensationalism. These two schools of thought offer contrasting visions of the end times, leaving us to wonder, what if the truth lies not just in the future, but in the past? Preterism suggests a revolutionary premise, what if the apocalyptic events described in the Bible have already occurred? Adherents believe that the prophecies found in the books of Daniel and Revelation were fulfilled in the 1st century AD, particularly during the destruction of Jerusalem in 70 AD. This interpretation places the pivotal moments of Christian eschatology in the past, inviting us to reconsider the relevance of ancient prophecy in our modern lives. Preterists argue that the cataclysmic events described in Scripture were symbolic of the fall of Jerusalem and the end of the Old Covenant, marking the triumph of Christ's kingdom, a spiritual reign rather than a literal one. On the other hand, dispensationalism offers a contrasting perspective, grounded in a literal interpretation of biblical prophecy. Dispensationalists divide history into distinct eras or dispensations, each marked by a different divine covenant. They hold that the prophetic events described in the Bible, particularly those in Revelation, are yet to be fulfilled. This view presents a future-oriented eschatology, where the world awaits the unfolding of the Great Tribulation, the rise of the Antichrist, and the eventual second coming of Christ. For dispensationalists, the Bible's prophecies are a divine blueprint, predicting a series of future events that will culminate in the establishment of God's kingdom on earth. These two interpretations, one rooted in the past, the other in the future, challenge us to think critically about the nature of prophecy and time. Is the kingdom of God already at hand, realized in the spiritual transformation of the world? Or do we await a future reckoning, when the divine plan will be fully revealed? The tension between these perspectives invites us to explore our own beliefs about destiny and the divine. As you reflect on these powerful eschatological themes, consider how they resonate with your own spiritual journey. Are you drawn to the idea of a past fulfillment, finding peace in the belief that the kingdom of God is already present? Or do you find hope in the promise of a future revelation, anticipating the ultimate victory of good over evil? Share your thoughts and let your voice be part of this timeless debate.